Yo, 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 what I got here is a 2012 Hyundai Elantra 2012 four cylinder 1.8 uh, non hybrid. But what I did was a motor in this thing, you know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna let you know if you change the motor in here, make sure that you get the motor that coming from a push button system, you know, like let's say this is push button. Let me show you what I mean by push button. Started push button. Get what I'm saying? So if you're changing out a motor and you got a push button, make sure you get one an engine that's coming from a push button system. Because you want the engine harness. You're gonna want the engine harness on that engine that's a push button. If you if you got a push button car. Then you want an engine that's a push button. What I mean by harness, you need this harness right here. All this is connected to the engine. That's the engine harness. That's the power side, or it's the positive side, battery harness. It don't matter about that one. You don't worry about that one. This is what you worry about. You take it out of a push button. Let's say you got one that's using key. You know key fob or smart key. When you put that engine in, with that harness attached to it, the power won't start. So you're going to use your original harness from your push button and push back on the engine before you get an engine from the push button harness. Simple as that. I had to figure that out. But yeah, that's how you do it. Now the damn thing runs. So, let me show you how it runs. Let me show you that it runs. So I'm saving you some problems. Or if you have a problem, there you go, it's running. You know what I'm saying? So, suppose you get one that's got a push button. This engine been sitting a minute. So I just put some um, oil in it, antifreeze, let it run, new thermostat water pump. So yeah, that's what you need. Make sure you got your original harness for your push button system. Or you can take one from another car if you happen to get rid of the engine and the harness is still on that engine, you can go to any other car that's a push button system and get the engine harness and plug everything in. That's what I had to do, which is this one right here. That's your engine harness. This is your battery side harness that actually got the alternator. Yeah, alternator, starter, wire, and another connector, and then your battery, positive battery here, and this goes over to your fuse box. So this harness system right here is for a key unit, you know, on the side of the steering column. So if you just got a key, you stick it on the side of the column, boom, this will work in there, but it won't work in a push button system. Peace out.